<laughs> it began with a horrific murder. Black fellow accused of raping and killing a nine-year-old white girl. You think he did it? And a suspect ready to confess his crimes. Why did you sign the confession? They told me to sign him, so I signed him. But this time, there was someone to stand up for the accused. You couldn't possibly have killed him. The police beat the confession out of my client. I want you to tell me how you killed the girl. Never seen no little girl. What he encountered would divide the nation. There's no way that somebody like Max could have made that confession. Let's get the public excited about this case. You can't stop him from hanging. It will help him to swell the circulation of Mr. Murdoch's newspapers. It would challenge the system. He killed that little girl and he should hang. He's never been able to tell his version of what happened that day. Now, don't you understand that? The High Court cannot retry the case. There must be some grounds for appeal. He's trying to get run out of town. I'm trying to save Max's life. Never underestimate a lawyer's ego. And change the meaning of justice. You are attempting to undermine the legal system in this state. Don't be a fool. I'm a foolish man, Justice Abbott. I don't see a man with a black skin. I see a man with a black heart. I'm so certain that Max Stewart raped and killed that little girl that if no one else had the courage to hang him, I would pull the lever myself.